welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra's Lair. I'm your host, Larry the Chupacabra. We're back for more Slime Rancher here. It's a game out in early access. I'm playing version 0.2.3b. And when we left off, I was getting a bunch of new critters and was trying to build another pen. But these bad boys wanted to escape and eat my delicious chickens. What? They can't escape now, because... Oh, are they hungry? That might be the problem. Um, they can't escape because I gave them a high-walled pen to be living in forever. But I'll feed them today because I'm not a monster, technically. I'm a half-monster. I'm a chupacabra man. Oh, look at all these carrots and, and pogo fruit. You little devils don't even know what kind of deliciousness you're about to experience. Yes! Eat, my children. Eat and become fat and give me so much money. Oh, yes. Mmm, you sultry little harlots. Oh, yes. Look at you all. Feed me your plorts. Oh, yes. Get them inside of my cannon. Mmm. All right. Hot diggity. Yes, inside of your laser prison. Oh, man, we can already... Yeah, that actually working out pretty good. Now I'm feeling like a proper farmer. I'm making my own feed. I'm feeding it back to the animals. The ones that die, I turn into yet more feed and feed it back to them, causing mad slime disease. Oh, man, I'm I'm feeling more like a, fa a real farmer every moment. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. These slimes don't all seem very happy, though. Wonder why. Well, let me catch all of them before they try to escape. Nope. There is no escape once you're a part of the Chupacabra Ranch. This is, this is basically like Guantanamo for farmyard animals. So let's see. Put these back in here. Oh, I'm so rich already. You peasant animals don't even know. I feel like I'm gonna need, like, a bigger pen for these phosphor slimes. Well, let's find out. Yep, these guys are totally gonna get out, I think. Nope, that's not gonna work. I'm gonna need a bigger pen wall. Well, poopy doopy. Well, I could put the rock slimes in here to start with. Yeah, that works. Those guys have slightly more valuable poop. No, kitty, go, don't eat my chickens. Those are not for you. Stupid tabby slime. You know, this kind of reminds me of when I first tried to play, like, a long time ago, my sister had a, uh, she had, like, a really old kind of crap Pentium computer compared to today's computers. But she, uh, the only thing when I was given it, that was on it, for a game, was, um, there was like a sim farming game that came with the computer. And I remember there was an issue I had where animals would keep getting out of their pens unless you locked them in with, um, with like, the, the crossbars, the little... I use them in my own fences, because I live out in the country. Um, they're like little cross braces. And if you didn't put those on there, the cows, even in, like, even in, you know, regular real life, if you don't use cross braces, cows will push between the fence lines and then push out and, like, get into your pasture. Which is bad. I mean, I have horses and you don't want cows destroying your fence and the horses getting out. That's just a recipe for some sort of hellish disaster. Do I want another cat? I feel like I do. Come here, kitty. All right, I have a tabby slime now. Give me some more of this. I think I should come over here in a few minutes, and I think I should, like, harvest all of this food and all of these chickens. They spawn out of these little nests here in the woods. Or I could just let the animals eat all of them. That's not entirely out of the question. Uh, I guess I'll just gather up all this stuff. Why not? Actually, I'm going to leave this phosphorus plort here in the tunnel. 
And what I am going to do after sucking up this shit is what? Oh, I'm full of pink plorts already. Well, goodness me. Let me grab all this pogo fruit, and I'm gonna try and feed that fat guy on that island so he'll give me bacon. That's, uh, that's the current goal. Ow. That's my face, you slime bastards. That ain't how we roll. You're supposed to be like docile animals that are easy to subjugate. You're not supposed to defend yourselves. Uh, what does this look like? National Geographic? Oh, are you a s- oh, you're not asleep. I was gonna say, if you're asleep, I'm gonna be mad. Do you not poop? Okay, I guess I'm just wasting fruit on you. Alright. Wait, what if I feed him the shit of other- Um, maybe- I'm not gonna crossbreed animals today. That's just asking for trouble, it seems like. Okay. And these critters are starting to become a huge problem. Ooh, another rock plort. Yeah, or rock slime. I do need more rock slimes in my life. I have another glass sip of my coffee. I have way too many of these um, phosphorus plorts. And frankly, the phosphorus plorts might not even be that valuable. Like, they might be one of those critters that's way more of a pain in the butt than they're worth. So, I got pink plorts. Let's go deposit those in the old bankerino. Just so that we've got some delicious income coming our way. Yes, siree, Bob. Oh, wait, we have some rock plorts, too. Rock plorts are worth 50 bucks. Or, or no, those are worth 20. What's worth... What's worth uh, 50 bucks? There's a gold plort somewhere, too, that I can get a hold of. Oh, I have a mailbox. Welcome to the range exchange, and welcome to the far, far range. Uh, the Z Corporation would like to welcome you to the far, far range and extend our support in your bold new venture as a slime rancher. We look forward to you supplying us with a steady flow of plorts for which we will pay handsomely. We would also like to request that you exercise caution in your first few days on the range. Okay. Oh. So this is like a proper facility thing that we can do here. All right, let's get these high walls. And then I'm gonna suck up these rock slimes. I'm gonna fill this with phosphor slimes. All right, yeah, baby, yeah. Okay, we got some more carrots that I can harvest. I'll feed these to the Phosphor Slimes, because I'm fairly certain the Phosphor Slimes are worth more to me. So, what what's the goal here? Should I maybe exchange um, the crappier slimes for better slimes? So I'm not wasting, like, pen space? I'm thinking yes. Oh, you guys are escaping, damn it. Alright, this isn't gonna work. This ain't gonna work. Uh-uh. This ain't gonna work. Come here, you. Alright, yeah, this is a no-no. Yep, I was concerned about just this very thing. Alright, well, in the meantime, you bad boys can eat all these carrots. Okay. Um, well, I don't really need have anything to do with these so right now, so... Goodbye! This is how I dispose of animals. I just throw them off the cliff. Alright, well, I have rock slimes, which are pretty valuable, too. So we'll just throw those in there. Now, give me all these plorts. I need more money for things. Alright. We'll just put these slimes back. I mean, this game seems pretty simple and straightforward at the end of the day, but there is a certain level of complexity in the things you have to be concerned with. So that you're not wasting resources. So I'm probably going to want to get a bunch of these cats. So, come here, kitty. You're my, you're my new best pal. Okay, all of you guys, you guys just made the short list for disposal. 
So the cats are more valuable, so that's what I'm gonna spend the, the resources feeding. So all you pink boys, you're going straight into the soup. Okay. <laughs> I'm just- I'm just committing mass genocide of these animals. Oh, PETA's gonna love me. Space PETA, that is. Okay. And this is now my tabby pen. Sweet! Now we got room for stuff. Are you chickens still alive? You are. I'll go get you some friends, I think. Yeah! Chicken friends! Everybody loves chicken friends. Um, what's going on here? Any food that I can absorb? There's some carrots. Get a hold of these before you bad boys can. Maybe I want to start gathering up some of these Gigundo slimes. Or maybe not, I'm not sure. I feel like I should be preventing this wild crossbreeding of animals that goes on at night, but... I mean, if you want- if that's what they're into, man, whatevs. Okay, I guess that tree's not ripe. I'm not ripe and full of delicious pogo fruit. Um, hello. You're what I want. Got a nice rock slime thing going on. Some of these forts. I mean, I think that's kind of like a word play on boots. Lord boots. Oh wait, maybe I should be feeding these other animals poop. So that they will, like, get off of certain resource nodes. Yeah, I can't pick that up. I should definitely be investing in a silo soon, I think. I'm feeling silo. Feeling silage e. Silage, of course, being a thing that you make by putting a bunch of harvested material in a pile somewhere so that um, it can kind of ferment and then you feed it to other animals as feed. Ooh, kitties! I actually want the kitties. Oh wait, I want these too. Hey, give me these ports. I don't want you guys becoming too full of yourselves now. Give me these cats. I want the cats. I want the plorts too. Did you eat the did you eat those carrots I gave you? Good slime monsters. Who's a good little slime monster? Oh. Well, never mind. That didn't quite go as planned. Okay. Hey, come here, you. You're mine now. Ah, they're just eating each other, and it's gross. It's like going to a weird SM concert. Okay, that didn't do anything. Apparently the goal isn't to feed them bits of each other. Duly noted. Oh, you guys are- you guys are super angry. Why is that? Okay, you guys- you guys do what you're gonna do at night time. I ain't even- oh. Hello? What was that? Where did you go? Is that a golden lord that shitting machine? Did I just miss out on goodies? Oh, now I'm pissed. I think I just missed out on one of those good bacony pooping machines. Oh, it's one of you. Come here. You're not a thing. Nope. Come here. All right. I have to suck this stuff up to get rid of you. That was weird. All right. So those are what happens when rampant inbreeding happens, and it's bad, I would assume. Ooh, 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 more rock slime. Come here. You're mine now. Come, join my empire. Alright, yes! That was a good haul. We got some good animals. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with the amount of money we're making. So that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. I've been your host, Larry the Chupacabra. I'm gonna have another sip of coffee and catch you guys and gals next time. Make sure you like and subscribe for more, and if you've already played this game, feel free to drop me some delicious tips. And until next time, toodles everybody!